The sailing world has a new ambassador for the mental well-being of some of its younger recruits. The UK Sailing Academy, based at Cowes on the Isle of Wight, is a maritime charity that provides opportunities for children from all walks of life. And as Sarah Gom's been finding out, they're about to have a role model who's picked up advice from around the world. Small businesses and local teams, the heart of our communities. eBay sponsors ITV Regional Sport Reports. Around the world, yachtswoman Dee Kafari knows what it's like to be alone with only one's own thoughts for company. As the first woman to sail single-handedly and non-stop around the world in both directions, Dee Kafari MBE is well placed for her new role as the UK Sailing Academy's Youth and Mental Health Ambassador. Coming as a former school teacher before I changed careers, I have an understanding of some of the trials and tribulations that young people face and the realisation that today, after the last few years, where everything seems to be piling up at a critical time and age for young people looking for the future, they need support and help. And I was really delighted that UKSA want to focus on this and actually address the issue and try and do their best. It is, of course, no coincidence that some of the most well-worn words used to describe feeling low are derived from the sailing world. Even if the farthest we've sailed is across the channel by ferry, most of us can empathise with feelings akin to being lost at sea or in the doldrums. And Dee understands that events of the last two years have compounded those concerns among the young and old alike. Today, to be a young person, it's so stressful and it is so difficult. And I know we've all been there, but life was very different. The last couple of years, they've been isolated. Schools have been shut. They haven't been allowed outside, seeing friends, family, loved ones. They may have even lost friends, family and loved ones. And it's just too much. And I think it's really important that we give them options. We give them access. And we all know that or for me, especially being on the water, but being outside, interacting with others, it is a breath of fresh air, literally and figuratively speaking, that sometimes makes the difference. Dee's next challenge keeps her a little closer to home. She's teaming up with Olympic sailor Shirley Robertson to take part in the seven-star round Britain and Ireland race. Sarah Gom, ITV News.